Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Um, this is going to be the first week of July's favorites. Um, so, shall we get started? Alright, again, welcome back to Makeup Addiction. Uh, my name is Sherry and I will be presenting with you the first week of July. The, so, so far, the products that I've tried in July, the products that I've liked the most. And number one, uh, well, I'm not going to say there's a number one because there's never a number one. I love all makeup. Um, so in June's favorites, I had presented to you guys a lip product by Soap and Glory, the Sexy Mother Plumper, Plucker, Pucker, something like that. Um, and they just came, well, Alta just got the Pillow Plump XXXL by Soap and Glory. And it's the Sexy Mother Pucker Pillow Plump XXL, like I just said. Clear, I got the clear one, um, and this one's even more better than the last one. This one is man it will definitely plump your lips it doesn't hurt it feels almost good to me i don't know maybe i'm worried I, oh short story about my bangs i tried cutting them and things just went downhill from there so i'm hoping that they will grow out soon so sorry yeah i'm sorry okay so one of my favorite bands I cannot talk today. One of my one of my favorite like drugstore brands at Alta is Makeup Revolution, and I bought this Ultra Contour Palette again from uh, Makeup Revolution. Um, I think there's like colors in here that could pretty much suit anybody. There's cool, there's warm, and it comes with um, these eight shades. You got a yellow banana color. There's two highlights, um, and then there's like this one's my favorite. It's like a cool. This one's kind of like a warm, and this one's kind of dark for my complexion. I use it to contour. I use it to bronze. I use it to just pretty much every day. Um, and I just got this the other day. It is the Makeup Revolution Neutrals versus Neutrals. I'm in love. To me, this could possibly very well be a dupe for the Anastasia Beverly Hills Modern Re Renaissance Palette, which I'm hoping I'm getting this week, but we'll see. You know, I just uh, bought the... Swamp, Swamp Queen palette, so we'll see. Um, the colors. Look at these colors. They are absolutely beautiful. There's some neutrals. There's some very beautiful cranberry shades in there. Um, I'm in love because this is totally right up my alley. This is calling, it had my name on it. I had seen someone else talk about this on um, YouTube, and I seen some of the cranberry shades. It's got some dark browns. It's got some dark purples or some shimmer shades it's got pretty much everything you could need so yeah i'm definitely in love with this i've used it a couple times and it is really good um for the price point um let's see another product here that i'm um well i don't know if this is a favorite but i thought i'd add it to the collection um it's by la colors um it is the i love makeup brow palette i haven't really used it too much um, cause I'm more of a pencil brow girl, you know, like the, the pomades and the powders, I get kind of, I don't know. I like a sharp brow, um, and pencils really do it for me, but I thought I'd add this because it's a really nice palette. I paid, I think like $6 for it. You can't go wrong. There's, you know, four, well, there's three powders, two pomades and well, there's four powders because one of them is white. It's like for a highlight. Uh, it comes with a pencil, comes with a spoolie. It came with some crappy tweezers and it came with some um uh like stencils i've never used that but i'll get back to you guys on that i don't know it's kind of scary like i said i'm just used to using um a brow pencil another makeup revolution product that i've had um i got this in probably june but i thought i'd present it into july's favorites um is the vivid baked highlighter powder and radiant lights it's a really, really pretty um, color. I have also golden lights. I had peach lights, but I took it back because that just wasn't my thing. Um, very good pigmentation in this. If you love a bright highlighter, then I would definitely check out the Makeup Revolution ones because they're $6 a piece. And hey, $6 a piece. Um, first, I got some lip products here. I got this. Um, this right here is a sample that I got with my uh, Mary Luminizer product. Uh, when I bought that, um, so this was like kind of like just the free gift um, by the bomb, and it's Meet Matt Hughes in the color uh, Committed. Beautiful, beautiful shade. 
uh, very comfortable uh, for the liquid lipsticks. You know, they're like dry and they can be very harsh to the lips. This, I really liked it. It was very comfortable. It lasts a pretty good long time. And the colors that they have are just outstanding. So, yes, that's a very good, very good lip product. A uh, lip product that I got that I thought I would present because I just got this in the past week or so is the Revlon Ultra HD Matte Colors. These do not dry down ever. Well, I won't say ever. Like after an hour, you'll be left with like, it's almost like a stain, but not, it's not like how you, when you put it on, it's like a gloss, but it's very comfortable. And the shades that they got are really, really pretty. This color right here is called uh, HD Kisses and it's gorgeous. I'll do a little swatchy swatch for you guys so you can see what I'm talking about. Very, very pigmented. And just a beautiful color. I mean, if you're into berries, like I'm into berry, like the berry more, you know, um, kind of like a burgundy. Yes, this is a good one. And they have some other good shades. And last but not least, I'm going to present with you get to you guys makeup brush cleanser by Japanese. This stuff, OMG, I used it throughout the whole month of June. That's why I'm presenting it to you in July. Um, like seriously, you do one spray on a dirty makeup brush, wipe it off on some Kleenex or some tissue. You got a clean brush. It doesn't need no dry down time. It's basically like a citrus oil. Very, very nice scent, to, nice scent to it. And it works really good. I was shocked because I was just, I was looking for something like this. And when I found it, um, I bought it and I buy it all the time. It's $6 for this little bottle. I'm sure they have bigger bottles, but you can get this right in the little, um, basically impulse buy section on the way out of Alta. You know how they have them little racks by the checkout? Well, that's at least my Alta. So that is it. I think I'm catching up. I think I'm getting more comfortable in front of the camera. Um, again, I'm still, I need to, some time to get a, a good camera to, for, you know, a real one. So right for right now, I'll be using my phone. Please forgive me for, for that. I'm trying. And I don't know. I have tons of stuff I can present to you guys. Tons of reviews I can give you guys. Because I have tons of makeup. So... <laughs> That's why that's, this channel is named Makeup Addiction because I have a problem. I'm hoping, like I said, to get the Modern Renaissance palette by um, Anastasia Beverly Hills this week. Hoping, hoping, hoping. Going to be begging my boyfriend. <laughs> so, all right. Well, thank you if you're watching these videos. Um, if you're not and you're just new starting, I'm appreciative to anybody that watches. Um, makeup is it's a beautiful thing. It gives me confidence. Like... You know, without it, I'm okay, but at the same time when I put it on, I'm like, yes, girl, yes. Like, you can, can't tell me nothing. So, all right. Well, I hope you guys have a beautiful day. Um, I hope you guys had a good fourth, and with that, I shall be gone. So, until next time, stay well, and um, keep, buying the make keep buying that makeup girl and boy, whoever's watching this. Don't be shy. Makeup's beautiful. Don't let nobody tell you different. So, all right. Love you guys. Bye.